I oh, respectfully no, not, decline. Not the zestiness Why? again. I would like to sincerely apologize to Dylan Latham. You've had a crush on my mom. And you <laughs> Have actually, I? You, you wrote her love letters. Yeah, let's spin this on you, Haven. Let's ask you some questions. <laughs> Could take a bear in a fight if we're in the woods and we don't have guns. 100%. You're tripping. Karma's a witch. I should have known better if I had a wish. What's up, brothers? Welcome back to the TikTok Riz Party. Today we have Gibson and Brandon once again. I'm just kidding. Welcome to Unsafe Haven. We have a new episode going, but we have some returning guests. How are you guys doing? That was not the agreed upon introduction. I was, doing, I was doing all right, but then you just hit us with that, so I don't know how I feel right now. You guys wouldn't want to be in the TikTok Riz Party? Okay, if we are in the TikTok Riz Party, I'm Turkish Quandale Dingle. I just want to know my Let's get that I want to know what my Who's lore Turkish would be. Turkish Quandale Dingle? I I'm Turkish Quandale Dingle. You haven't been watching TikTok Riz Party lore, though. I wasn't, I, invi I wasn't invited to the TikTok, TikTok Riz Party. Dude, can we talk about... Okay, I saw a video about this on my For You page the other day, and I, I, don't, I reposted it, actually. Can we talk about how these kids... these what? Do you, how old do you think they are? Like, 15? Dude, uh, 15, 16 probably. Do you think it's a middle school party? I, that I don't at? know. No, it was it was a sweet 16. But oh. how how are they? They're like smart. Like they know what they're doing. Like, what do you mean they're smart? Bro, they they kept it going on. Like it was the war is all That's over true. all over everybody's for you. Pages. It was a great publicity stunt. Yeah, I exactly saw videos was. that these kids are media trained. Yeah, that's what I. That's what I. Really <laughs> they are media trained. I, I, I just saw the group leader on my for you page. <laughs> yeah, literally. And he was talking about like Turkish. I don't know the other dude's name. Turkish but like, Dingle, four words. You think tomato in boy and white <laughs> shirt kids? Dude, come on, bro. You don't tomato know boy. <laughs> tomato boy. You yeah. think they're media trained? He's a dude with dude, the red face. Okay, can we talk about red dress girl though? I have no comment. What's that mean? You know she is, or do you like her? No, she's 16. I have no comment. Oh, she's too. Actually, in Florida, it's you can be 21 and 16, though, I think. The Romeo and Juliet law. Nope. It's still legal for you, buddy. Nope. <laughs> is that a law? No, the Romeo and Juliet thing, I thought that was 18 and 16. I thought it was 16, 21. Because, <clears throat> like, know. 18 is the legal age of consent. I feel like you should know that. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm fine. I, I'm, I, yeah, I, I, I have no worries. That. That. I don't really saying, go for 16-year-old girls. I, I heard Fair. it from frat guys, though, so that probably makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? I don't know. So what happened to your voice? My voice is fine. All right. Well, my voice. Mike, Brandon, Brandon was telling us this story. <laughs> story of how... Story of you how you lost friend. your voice. Tell us. Yeah. I was cheering so loud during my last game of the season that I oh. lost my voice and I've yet to recover it. It's oh, been two it, months. Wasn't your last game yeah, two months ago? Yeah. That's a little bit suspicious. I was just really into the game. So what did you guys do this week? Why is the look camera so far back there? I can't even look Because you're not in it. It's only me now. I'm Why is it character. only you? That's so stupid. It was my idea to have the camera there in the first place. Because it looks better on me. Well, it was my idea, and now you're... I don't like this anymore. You don't like it? Yeah, let's spin this on you, Haven. Let's ask you some questions. <laughs> okay, let's So go. how about uh, your your promposal this year? How What's the plan for that? Bro, I have no clue. No clue? Gabby's, Gabby, you got to be watching this right now. He has no idea. Dude, I have like 20 days. I promise tomorrow, and he has no idea. Dude, your prom is in like two weeks. Dude, it's tomorrow. It's in three weeks. So I have like 21 days. Dude. All right, what do I do? What do I do? What's a good proposal? I don't know. I never did a proposal. I've got, I've got time. Mine's in like a month and a half. Yeah. You gonna ask Colette? Bro, what? Hmm? You gonna ask Colette? So, bro, thinks that... <laughs> who who would you ask if you don't ask her? Yeah. You. I oh, respectfully no, not, decline. Not the zestiness again. We're, we're, let's leave that in the Dylan no, episode. No, but I thought we were edgy. <laughs> 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 no, but seriously, though. La like the last time we had prom, I asked my girlfriend with a illegal prom pose. Like I had a cop pull me over. It was a whole wow, production. That's really unsafe, man. It was a whole production, but I don't know how to top that. Like I feel like I have to top that, or can I just go like the basic route with a poster? Just make a poster. I don't have to top it. It's all about the. It's all about the the, the thought, you know. Yeah, yeah but so if he, has last, to, he has to top it if it's. Yeah, because last time that if I had more effort last time, wouldn't she be like? Bring the SWAT team. Okay, so just do something different this time. Instead of doing a poster, like do something like a different like sort of act, you know. You yeah. gotta make her some flowers, you know? Come on. You get Obviously, flowers. I've taught. No, you gotta make them. Oh my god. You gosh. get the Lego flowers. I have a video. So they last forever. Ooh. Ooh. Someone okay, out bad. there, uh, give me the Lego flowers. Oh, you're a Lego please. boy. When I did you Lego find boy. your love for Legos? I was about five years old and it never left. Do you still play with them? I do play with Legos still. When was the last time you played with Legos? Uh, this morning. No way. I have a Lego Yoda in my room. I, I do not believe that you played with Legos this morning. Define what do you played mean? with them. Did you like just like touch something. your Yoda? And I was like, oh. I like moved his lightsaber a Why'd little you bit. Touch Yoda like that. He's <laughs> like, yeah, I didn't the pet the, the Yoda. I'm like, when was the last time you built Legos? A month ago. 
probably. I just haven't bought a Lego it's recently. You're a weirdo. I, what do you mean? I, I like Legos. Bro, Legos are for like little kids. I didn't That's like That's not Legos, true. I get, like, I get like the, the, the you're big a Lego basketball player. Why are you still playing Legos? I'm sorry. I have, I'm sorry because I'm a D1 basketball player. I can't have hobbies. <laughs> I have a hobby. I like building my Legos. It's fun. Do right. you guys build Legos? Uh, dude, your audience is 10. I yes, used they build to be Legos. a huge... They're actually they build 11. Legos. I used to be a huge Lego <laughs> fanatic, but I haven't touched them in a long that time. Really so. Brandon loves to whisper while Bob Gibson talks. Because, yeah, and you can't hear huh? it anyway. No, no, you can't. I watched my <laughs> video. I watched my episode. You can't well, hear cause it. Because you know what you said, so you can kind of hear it, but it's mm-hmm. really hard to interpret what you say. Yeah. I'm sorry. I like your uh, really cool brand of water you have there. Yeah, I'm drinking the... Wait, isn't that the... Yeah, that's the... No, oh, no, no, the, I thought that was the... Yo, do you, here, here's some of the... Let me get a taste test on the... Yeah, you, you can taste the... Did you drink out of this? I did not. I tried to open it, but I was unable to. Here, I'll give it a waterfall. That, that's okay. He's drinking the... How was the... Mmm. It tastes rather... Can I have some of the... Mm. the? This episode was actually sponsored by the... <laughs> Everyone drink the because yeah, really the cool. ones to sponsor us. Let us know. <laughs> no, but seriously, it's if you guys, the, it's called. <laughs> it's called. <laughs> He's just drugging it now. I seriously though, if you want to sponsor us, you know, shot, we can, shot, shot, <laughs> shot, 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 shot. You can put your drinks here, right? Right, brands. We're very family friendly brands. Yeah, I'm sorry about the ASMR. We're there, not guys. edgy, unlike he said. We're very super we, nice. Um, are we nice? I'm nice. Are all of us nice I'm on the this podcast? I'm the nicest on the podcast. Because I recall some of us, you know, making some other people on the podcast mad, some guests, perhaps. Okay, guys. I recall one of your three guests leaving yeah. <laughs> so far. That's well, actually, like a, you only have a 66% success rate. And that's failing. All right, look, we evolve. We get better. We learn. I think there was a little bit of an overreaction, but I also think maybe I was a little bit in the wrong. Is this your apology video? All right, guys, I'm yeah, going to apologize. Make an apology yeah, video. Make an apology video. Here, use, <sighs> use the for fake tears. Yeah, yeah, here. <laughs> no, okay, I'll, I can, I, okay. I would like to sincerely apologize to Dylan Latham for my severe and continuous lapse of judgment. I should not have brought up your... I don't believe that. Um, I should have just been nice and nice and not calling your hair clapped. So please accept this apology. It won't happen again. I'd love to meet up and make up. And, and what? Meet up and make out? Make up. Oh, okay. <laughs> make up. Squash. Let's squash the beef, Dylan. There is no need for beef. I want to be friends again. Comment down below if you think that was genuine. It was so genuine. Comment uh, down below. I don't know, guys. And we'll see what the people think. I agree with everything people say. All right, look. Let's talk about that whole situation, all right? <laughs> yes. He asked me not to bring up an <laughs> name. But he didn't say not to bring up the whole topic itself. He's just like, don't I get the specifics. I was there when he asked you not to bring it up. Yeah. And he just broadly said, hey, don't bring up that topic. No, he didn't. Yes, he, he did. He said, don't bring up yes, this girl's did. name. He said, don't bring it up. Okay. I understand that, but is that storm off level worthy? I mean, I don't know. If you sit there and you're like, hey, I'm not going to remove it from the pod. What do you think? I have no comment. I was not there. You watched it, right? I did. So I don't know the full backstory, so. But what do you think from what you saw? I also don't know the entire backstory because he was staying at your house. This is all I think. I think from what I saw mm-hmm. on the podcast as a viewer, because I was a viewer in that situation, mm-hmm. was what it seemed like was you said something he didn't want you to say, and he got upset about it. Yeah. That is what ha- that's just right, what I, I saw. I agree. Okay, happened. so the entire podcast, I mean, we're kind of coming for each other. I understand I was mean. He was mean too. I was such a bystander the entire podcast. If you guys saw my reactions during that entire podcast, was, was so like, entertained. I was just like, uh, <laughs> and he was like walking out, and I was like, uh, and I was like, hey, Ben, uh, yeah. what's going but on? Seriously, uh, I think I, I think uh, it was blown a little bit. <laughs> I think it was blown a little bit out of proportion. I needed a little bit of the. And me and him have actually talked since, and needed. I think I think we're on like we're. I've For made the, like a public apology video, like I just did now, but like me and him are on better terms now. Like I apologized to him off camera. You know, sometimes you got to keep things offline guys not everything you see is what's going on so we're, 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 was we're the, chilling was the now. second camera look really necessary on that yeah offline, <laughs> <laughs> offline. But we're, we're like we're like chill now like 
I, I think there, there, there's a chance of us hanging Dude, out bro, again. bro, we're like I so all that. totally chill now, Sorry, bro. Our, our producer is watching my Snap story right now, so I'm really in. Yes, yeah, <laughs> wait, speaking of... Uh, guys, if you, been, been, if you haven't been watching <laughs> my Snap story... I'm speaking just, of not putting everything online, it's too late now. And we do Snapchat. Yeah. We post our entire, <laughs> entire lives, lives on Snapchat. Bro, it's bro, actually it's good. We post more on Snap I post on TikTok. What I do, 40, 50 story posts today? That's absurd. Yeah, It's worth a grind, bro. It's so much. It's worth a grind. Hey, man. Dude, I, I gotta no, show I do the it too. people. I do it too. I gotta yeah. show the people what, what you know, what I do in a day. Yeah. They're interested. Day in the but life. Yeah, that's how you started. Co- Dude, that is how I started. Oh, are I we guess. getting producer we're, on the we're, podcast? We're, we're, right? we're, we're getting producer reveal. reveal. Producer reveal. Right, guys, so the person that made us refilm the Gibson and Brady episode five <laughs> times. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Man. That is true because talent. Follow me on Instagram at. No, shameless self plug. Five seconds in. Oh, nah. Bro, you seven say lens, <laughs> seven lens. Well, that's oh, our producer, seven, guys. Man. Just all jokes aside, we appreciate him. He helps us. He helps set everything up. Plus. He helps us out here. He's he's got some knowledge. So thank you, Talon. Clap it up for Talon, guys. <laughs> what is he talking? About? <laughs> but um, I, dude, I saw this video on my for you page the other day where there was like a cruise, right? And then there were inmates that escaped the prison on like this life raft. And the crews like picked them up and they went to jail in the cruise. But then I was thinking, I'm like, yo, what, you know what the- Are you be- describing like one of your dreams right now? No, no, I'm talking about a TikTok I saw. I, I saw a TikTok where inmates were escaping on like a inflatable boat and then they- got This actually the happened? Cruise. Yes. Like I saw like last, like it's a TikTok from last month, but I saw it two days ago. And I was thinking, I'm like, yo, you know what's a good, good way to get into a cruise for free? Get an inflatable raft, follow the cruise on the inflatable raft for one or two days. And then yeah, because you're gonna be able to keep up with it. And then just like wave, like you just like got escaped from like a stranded island. How? Okay. <clears throat> How in the world are you gonna follow a cruise ship <laughs> on an inflatable raft? <laughs> Why would you want to go through all that effort? Even dude, just was bu- gonna cruises aren't free. that expensive. It's yeah. like, you, dude, if you want to go on a three day cruise, it's not cruises that bad. Cruises are a bag. Dude, I'm not saying you gotta go on the two week around the globe Bro, cruise. A cruise is gonna cost you at least a band. Can you go band for band okay, with a first kayak? Of all, that's free, oh, first that's like of all, bucks? kayaks are not $50, yeah, they're like bro. Couple hundred. Like bro you can buy one? a single piece of driftwood for 50 bucks. That's all I need. That's all I need. Why, is, why are you looking? You stared at the producer, not the camera. Where's the... Oh, is, yeah, because the, the, the camera's, two cameras... The second looking? camera's only on you, so I didn't know I was allowed to look at that camera. Look at this. Look at me. Oh, my God. Look, look, look. But no, I, first of all, no. If I want to go on a cruise, I'm just going to buy my ticket for the cruise. I'm not going to go buy a raft, tirelessly paddle for 48 hours straight, I'm and gonna then stuff act like myself, I was marooned. I'm going to stuff myself in Brandon's suitcase. That is fine. I'm I glad mean, you, probably, you were you going with fit. suitcase yeah. there. I did not know where that sentence was going. <laughs> Whoa. The <laughs> zest uh, uh, just, co- it always comes back. It always comes back. It always <sighs> does. It always does. But yeah, uh, we're so edgy here on Unsafe Haven. Of, speaking of crushes and zest, on the line of crushes, Gibson, we've had this thing going on for about a couple of years where uh, you've had a crush on my mom, and you <laughs> Have actually I? you you wrote her love letters. Oh yes, I wrote her. I wrote we're her we're gonna address letters. that today. Is this real? We're gonna unpack on the fact that he writes my mom love letters like for Christmas. That would be something. Under my I feet. actually did not write her a Christmas card this year, and I'm very uh, I'm very disappointed in myself per se. You, I, but I should but have you've done, done that. Oh yeah, so I wrote last her. I, I think it was only once. I wrote her one Christmas letter. That's know? still a love letter. Well, I made it a Christmas love letter. I mean, you gotta add some Christmas spirit, Christmas joy to it, you know. Why? Why did my mom? Because you know she's a lovely woman. She, um, you know, she feeds me and she houses me whenever I need, and she, she's very polite and she's very. How would you feel if someone was talking to your mom like that? I would feel great because you know it's the truth. You feel great if your boy was running love letters to your mom. Yeah, man. Would you support a relationship with one of your friends and your mom? Are we being for real right now? <laughs> a relationship is different than writing love letters. What do you think, Brandon? Uh, personally, I've never written a love letter to any one of my boys' moms before. But mm-hmm. all to you, Gibson. If that's what it was, a it, Christmas card, and it said. Something along the lines of well, meet me under the mistletoe. Of, no, it was something like like, I hope you have a very very merry Christmas, and because we were playing keep the balloon up at your house, remember? Yeah, yeah, I remember. <laughs> I remember clearly and, finding that note under my mom and, under the Christmas and tree. And it was my mom funny. It, it was funny, and I and I wrapped it and everything, and it was like it was like okay, I love you. Have a very good Christmas. Kiss kiss heart heart, and that was it. 
Not you don't think that's weird at all? Not even a little bit weird? Not not particularly, no. no. I think it's unique. It's unique. It's definitely unique. Would I've you never, care if Gibson uh, did that to your mom? I mean it's Gibson. I think you'd be delighted. Delighted? What it's about Michael? What if Michael did it to you? I'd be mom? very concerned. Michael, <laughs> oh, they don't know Michael. Do you guys know Michael? Know Michael? Oh, they know Michael. Mikey Z, Mikey Z. I know he's watching this right now. He's actually our filmer for he our TikTok. He definitely is watching this right now. Yeah. Mike, Mikey Z is a he's a character. We got to get him on. I love soon. Michael. I love Michael. We're seeing Michael this weekend. I would <laughs> I would write love letters to Michael. That they, I, those that would I, be yeah. very. Do you always just deeply, find a way to make it gay. I don't find dude, anything. Dude, you can write a love letter to your boy. Yeah, I don't like, think it's gay if like, I wrote a love letter Yo, bro, I appreciate our friendship and stuff. Like, it's like, yo, Brandon, like, I really want to kiss you right now. <laughs> See, like, I didn't say that part. I just said, like, yo, bro, I appreciate but, like, our friendship. I was friendship. obviously kidding, so. Yeah. Please, someone help me, bro. Bing. Dude, you dropped the the. Dude, not the. We're not sponsored. Dude, Please sponsor don't, us. Don't hit the. I'm sorry. Yeah, I hit the hit the table, which knocked over the. Should we get some props for the table, guys? <laughs> the table's very empty right now. What, what props? Are what you guys props liking our, our nice wood table we got here? It's a beauty. You are, you are not reading that book. <laughs> you open that book to page ninety-seven. Our producer is reading a JD Rob book. I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna get a book and read it to you guys. Are you for real right now? You he can talked read. about this before the podcast started. He said, guys, would it be a funny segment if I grabbed a random book and started reading it? And I said, absolutely not. It was that a unanimous no. The most including our producer. Thing. It was a three to zero, one vote. Yeah. And he's still doing it. <laughs> it must the be most nice. boring segment ever. So, Brandon, how are you doing today? I'm doing all right. the most boring book <clears throat> I'm, uh, you know, I'm doing my thing. What, what is that? It doesn't have a cover. Is that the dictionary? <laughs> no, it's 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 the. Oh yeah, it's yo. You're reading. It's the. I'm reading. It's it. Look, it's it. It's, it's yo, 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 yo. You know you know what the book's about. It's the. You want to know what the guys, book's guys, about? Guys, I want to show you something it's special the. though. Safe Haven. Safe Haven book. What Wait, am I looking at? But what about the book? Guys, oh. it's the. No, no. That that book's about. The. Let me read Dude, the. shut up, bro. You're not funny. <laughs> Don't read, kids. <laughs> I thought you were gonna like. Read it. Don't read books. Watch our videos and brain rot. And listen to audiobooks. That's what I have I a short attention span. I'm a big audiobook me. guy. I am. I don't, I don't yeah, know I, I, this guy pulls up in his car today, and he. What were you listening to? A podcast or something? I was listening to. Uh, <laughs> I was listening to a YouTube video called Three Terrible Fates." Fates? <laughs> yeah, because I listen. I, I like listening to like scary stories. Scary stories. Yeah, you I mean, Brandon but, told me he watches last night. Oh yeah, I'm little not, kids play Minecraft. Not, not little kids. You not said little kids, little kids play little Minecraft. Kids. I, I watch a little kid game, which is Minecraft. I watch like people play it. I is mean, that not what I just do said? You watch Dream? I, I do watch Dream. I think Dream's so entertaining. I don't care. It's fake. It's so entertaining. It's fake. It is very entertaining. I used to watch you it a couple. You didn't years think it was ago. fake? I thought it was real. No, bro. No. The 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 Hunter verse. I mean, maybe the first couple were real, but dude, when it got to like one v five, I don't yeah, know I if that's. Real. I don't think that's fake. I think it's fake. Guys, are the Dream videos fake? What's the best game of all time, though? Minecraft. Minecraft? I think it's Terraria. I think it might be Minecraft. Actually. I think it's Minecraft. Minecraft's top three for sure. I think unanimously it's Minecraft. Uh, or GTA producer, 5. what are you thinking? Fortnite. Oh, Fortnite. Oh, yeah. Fortnite, Fortnite. Yeah. Fortnite, Fortnite might Fortnite. be Can we good. fire this guy? Well, Fortnite's a good game, bro. Of all time. Terraria is on my not all like Terraria? It's, Terraria? That's just worse Minecraft. Yeah. yeah. It's a better Minecraft. It's, it's not. not. It's a terrible Minecraft. Yeah. I can't lie to you. Okay. Yeah. You know, I, I don't... Oh, no, that's no, a good answer. No. That is a good answer. You know, I don't want to expose Haven here, but Haven just went on a fo- went on his phone. Haven has a screen t- a phone addiction. It is bad. What? You were addicted to your phone. I don't, I don't you were just about. telling me about this yesterday. I'm looking at the notes for Dude, the talking me, points. Me, me and Haven, talking points me and, for today. Me and Haven were at dinner, and he asked the waitress <laughs> for the restaurant's <laughs> Wi-Fi because the service in the restaurant was bad. That's valid. That's not, you don't need to be on your phone. Like, it's we're valid at dinner, like, like we we're to, chilling. Like, I need to like post a video right now. All right, no, it's valid yeah, because we were watching March Madness games. I'm not going to lie. Like, I'm not a big sports watcher. Just watch I, it. You had. I think, I think that's a hot take. I mean, that's a hot take. I don't think you need to be a big basketball sports guy to be To just enjoy March Madness. Yeah. It's yeah. overrated. Like last night. Mar- March Madness is not, not overrated. 
Can we talk? Can we talk about uh, your uh, your March Madness bracket right now? Did you have a? Good oh, I, I got cooked. Uh, my mine's mine's. I got the whole Final Four wrong. Really? Yeah. Can we I, talk I, about? I had Iowa State winning it all, and they you lost. You didn't have UConn in it at all. Well, if I picked UConn, I wouldn't like my bracket. UConn girls good. or UConn guys? You UConn, UConn, UConn guys. girls have got. You go, UConn girls have had a lot of hype recently. What do you guys think about that? Name one player on UConn women's basketball team. I have no idea because I, I have a girlfriend. I don't look at that, but I know they've got a <laughs> lot of hype. That has nothing, nothing to, to do, do with that. that. I just heard they got a lot of hype. Dude, I see so wait, so page, wait, like, so I see the UConn girls basketball team. <laughs> Hold on. I just like so. What? So so when you because you, you have a girlfriend, you can't watch women's sports. No, but like I don't know their names because I don't really care. Oh, is that where JoJo Siwa plays? <laughs> That's who you whispered. <laughs> yeah, it is. She's number twelve. Oh, is that? Is that where Caitlin Clark plays? Clark Ken, Ken Clark. Clark Ken, Ken is Superman. Caitlin Superman. Clark. Caitlin Clark. Where did I? Where did Michael want to go on the map? Iowa. Europe. No. Iowa. 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 Is that where Caitlin Clark plays? Yes. Oh okay. yeah. She just lost. Dude, yeah. you it's, said you said that you could get beat by Caitlin Clark in a one v one. Yes, I would. You have no confidence in yourself. If you're Dude, be a she's good the athlete, greatest women's college basketball player ever. But you have to I have no yourself. career points and have played in two college games. She is beating me one on one. I am completely going to be transparent. Is about she that. though? But you, you have, have just confidence. Like, you could just body slam her. She falls. Dude, she's my height. We're both six two. But you got that dog in you. You got the dog. Dude, in you? she has four, basically four thousand points. Hey, Bro, man. you have to have confidence in yourself, or you're never going to achieve anything. You're triple zero. Triple zero is she triple again. zero? She's not triple zero. No, she's four thousand, a thousand, and a thousand. Yeah, she's <laughs> triple zero after a four. <laughs> yeah. Caitlin Clark, yeah. Brandon Dwyer is challenging four. you There's to a four a before one. her triple zero. He's challenging you, Caitlin. I'm not. Except Caitlin, challenge. I love what you've done for women's basketball, and I'm a huge fan. Yeah, I he's challenging you to a wrestling. I would love to. Okay. <laughs> she's a man's. Well, you got the dog in you though, Brandon. Are you a big dog or little dog guy? Uh, he likes them. What do you mean in terms of like, if like I, dogs? Dogs? Like oh, dogs. I, didn't, I thought you meant dogs. like if I had like a big dog in me or like the little dog in me. <laughs> I, I like a li- I'm a cat person personally. What? I, I like cats. You like cats? Yeah. I don't, I'm not a dog guy. My, my family has a cat. His name's Louie. He's great. He's an orange Ooh. cat. He's great. Louie sounds I, like a weirdo. I did this like quiz Louis Louie doesn't like me very much, like, but he's great. When we have our little bonding moments, he's he's... Nice little guy. I did this little quiz thing, and it said I was an orange cat, not a golden retriever, and that was kind of sad. I'm sorry. I personally like dogs. What do you? Cats. What you do? What I'm did you do that? Well, I don't inclusive. hate cats, but dogs over cats any day. I don't. Yeah. Why well, don't dislike dogs? I just I'm a cat guy. I like cat. Like, like when I get my own place, I'm gonna get a cat. They're so yeah. quiet. Yeah. All right, yeah, but big great. dogs or little yeah. dogs then? Little dogs. Big dogs little scare dogs. me. Yeah. What about you? I don't know. Like if a little, if a big dog ever got mad at me, I'm cooked. But if a little dog got mad at me, I'm I'm cooking a little dog. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Yeah, probably little dogs. That's what I'm, I'm saying. Not scared of big dogs, dude. If I if I see a Great Dane dude, rushing at me, what do you think he's me, gonna do to you? Mess me up. No, dude. If he's mad, if he's like out for blood, I'm cooked. Nah, You're no. cooked too. This That's, guy has no confidence in himself at all. A, a dog dude, would I'm not beat you up. I'm just realistic. It's a dog, bro. It's a little. Would you? Even if it's would a you? Big dog, would you still, beat the dog body. in the fight? Yes. Yes, but would the dog do damage? No. Yes, it would. No. You're no. tripping if you think that. I'm just like valid. if you're thinking of like a Chihuahua. Okay. I'm thinking nothing. of like a Doberman. You're cooked. You're you're you're, you're 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 coming I'm away from that fight and you're in pain. You're hurting. Mm-mm. Yes, you are. No. Um, you just have. I have a question. I have a question then. I, because okay, I have a question. He has a question. Last year on my basketball team, we had this running question. Would you think? That you, me, Gibson, and our producer could take a bear in a fight if we're in the woods and we don't have guns. 100%. You're tripping. 100%. You're absolutely tripping. So Easily. Right. We're Easily. all bears. Yeah. We're, we're you're, smart you're bears. tripping, bro. It's a bear. Oh, like a grizzly yeah. bear. You're done. Dude, you no. Bear bro. No. Help you. We would, dude, I, I would take a bear one on one. Easily, I don't know one, if you dude, take him one on one. I take one on one. Like no, I don't. Weave, hold on, I, weave uppercut. Do you know how big a bear is? No, really. A bear is an apex well, predator. Realistic. You have you, you, dude. We own the world. Yeah, we own the world. No, you need our bears, brains, to, bro. I would use my brain to kill the bear. What? You just. <laughs> they look at it really hard. I would look at the bear. <laughs> I look. I look at the bear and I'd look around and I'd make a phone. 
And I look at the phone. And you make a phone. Okay. Well, clearly the guys no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> and then about. I let you guys Dude. fight the best. First of all, okay, there's okay, nothing. Wait, wait, wait. No, no. Our best how shot. Did, how did, speaking of making a phone out of thin air, how did we make Bluetooth from grass, from nature? Dude, I, I, think it's, I don't know. I think I, cool. I've seen this. I've seen sense. this. Bluetooth is a hoax. How does Bluetooth exist? There's just no way, right? Dude, it doesn't make any Bluetooth sense. Bluetooth exists the same way that Haven's going to defeat a bear one-on-one. Okay, no. The bear, a bear? We can defeat a bear. A bear is absolutely destroying The three of us can take on a bear. Bro. No. I myself could take a bear on. Well, okay, okay, okay. If you're so you do, confident. I would choke it out. That's really what I would do. I would choke it out or I'd get, make, make a weapon and then I'd kill it. That's how I get the bear. It's the bear and you. We are running full steam and you I have no time to get make behind a him. Choke it. Weapon. You're not choking a I'm bear. I'm choking a bear. I'm, the neck is the most. Do you know how big one. a bear is? Yeah, and I'm choking it. You know how big I am? You are six five. I'm a bear. Big. A bear has like. I'm big. A thousand pounds on you. I don't care how, wh- how heavy it is. And it's taller than you. I'll take it out by the legs, then I'll take it down, and I'll get on top, and I'll ground a pound. Ground and pound the bear. Yeah, <laughs> I know that. I know that bear is terrified. And once this it hears your strategy, is to ground top, and pound the bear. Get on top and ground. Ground and pound, and the bear. pound a bear. Okay. Oh my wow! Goodness. Please clip that. Clip that sentence. I'll get on top and ground and pound the bear. All right, we're gonna move on from the bear. We're gonna sing. I'm so excited. Hey, I'm singing today. This is my favorite bear. segment. This is your guys' favorite segment. And, is it? Uh, are you I just think, saying I, that? I for think them? it's their favorite segment. It's Haven's favorite segment. I love this segment. And today. We okay. have a special song. We're not even gonna say the name. We're just gonna we're just gonna start singing it. Well, I don't know what the lyrics. Oh, I'm, are. I'm gonna pop the lyrics for you. All right, ready? <laughs> it's by everyone's favorite. I'm artist ready to now. sing. I'm gonna get vocal. I'm gonna get loud. Michael, I'm gonna make you proud. Michael Zidell. That was a bar. I'm gonna get vocal. I'm gonna get loud. Michael, I'm gonna make you proud. Did I actually rhyme that? Yeah, you did. I didn't even mean to do that. No, that was good. Can man. we clip that? If we can, we could if you'd like. I mean, you have all control over that if you wanted to clip no, that. Uh, we're gonna sing. We're gonna sing like all of it, all, all like the whole entire thing. All right, you're gonna sing. Where this. do the good no, 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 boys? No, not that. I, I, no, no. You're gonna sing. A, I know all that's the way. Good boy. Right. I was a bad girl. I did some bad things. I swear I did it all for fun, and it meant nothing. Uh huh. It never, never happened. happened. Yep. It, it was, was a secret. secret. Okay. Like, like when, when a tree falls in the forest, forest no, no one hears it. it. Uh-huh. You're you're kind of messing up my. <laughs> okay, okay. Who wrote this, Doctor Seuss? <laughs> another late night, another crazy mood, and I didn't think twice what it would do to you. <laughs> <laughs> I was a wild child. You always knew it. It was a matter of time before I blew it. Thou shall not lie, thou shall not <laughs> cheat, thou shall not get caught, or you end up just like me. Oh, karma's a witch, I should have known better. If I had a wish, I would have never had the round, and I saw the pain with her. I felt the knife twist. <laughs> Where'd it go? Uh, 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 I'm all sorry. All of us together saying karma's a witch. Re- respectfully, I don't no, listen I to JoJo C. So was good. <laughs> That's going in, but always listening to karma's a witch, okay? Three, Three two, two, one. one. Karma's a witch. I should have known better. If I had a wish, I would have never. Guys, what's going on? <laughs> I was singing. <laughs> no, you weren't. It's what? by the JoJo C. Wolf. You haven't heard it, guys. Get out. You're living on a rock. You don't want to lose another guest. It's true. That'd be a yeah. 50% yeah. Guest, <laughs> guest kicked out. Well, actually, Gibson and Colette started off the last podcast to get a room. Bro, what? Yeah. That is not oh. what happened. <laughs> <laughs> what did this guy just do? <laughs> <laughs> Our producer's dead right now. That is, that is not oh actually Oh my gosh, what dude. Dude. This guy's lying again. We're at the pool right now, and I've been trying to convince my girlfriend. We're at the pool right now? Well, the pool's right over there. We're at, like, the pool clubhouse area of my community, and I've been trying to convince my girlfriend for so long that this summer she should wear a tankini. What are you guys' thoughts on tankinis? I don't know what a tankini is. It's like a bikini that's like a shirt, kind of. No, no, it's it's a a tan-colored... The tan one, right? Isn't it tan colored? No! I thought it was tan colored. I, I thought it was a tan. It's like a modest bikini. It doesn't show I know off it's a modest, but I thought it was, thought it was also tan. No, yeah, no, yeah, no, I no, thought it was a tan bikini. It's tan and modest. Wear, so it looks like no, you're naked. It's, it's not. Yes, ha- that's no. what it is. Yes. Oh, look up what tan kini, bro. Yeah, look, look it up. It up. I'll it's show you tan. what a tan kini is. It's tan. Tan kini. Why are you tan? in private browsing? That's a dress. <laughs> Why did Haven opened up his phone? That's a tan kini. What the heck? That's a dress. That's a tan kini. That's literally a tan kini. Okay, I mean, dude, if they want to wear stuff, if a girl wants to wear yeah, that, that's awesome. Oh my God. Yeah, it's better than bikini because it's more modest. I, I think that we should shift back to more modest outfits overall. I think a girl in a modest outfit is way better than a girl in, you know, 
bleep this. S*** it. <gasps> I'm canceling you. <laughs> Producer, you get that? Sorry. I bet. <laughs> Sorry. Right. I, uh, dude, I don't care. I just, <sighs> wear, wear, wear whatever you want, bro. I didn't even know what a tankini was. That's a All bikini. Right, our producer's just showing us half naked girls. No. <laughs> he's, right. having, he's having a blast. Next one. I'm telling brother, you. brother, we do not want to see that, brother. Brother, Next we all have girlfriends. Tuesday. Next one, brother. Next one, brother. Tuesday. <laughs> Tuesday. What are you guys thoughts on but sketch? I love sketch, dude. You know, all right. I don't I, I don't want to say this in a mean way, but it's going to come off really mean. Then don't say it. <laughs> hey, 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 no offense. You, I don't want to like mean, so, but this is going to That's like be someone mean. who says uh, no uh, offense <laughs> before they say like the most possible <laughs> offensive thing you could have right, possibly right, so said. So basically... Yeah. Haven just said the worst possible thing you've ever girl. heard. Or, 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 or actually, thing. no. No, no, keep their reactions. Bro, you just got to understand if you are already thinking before you're going to say something. There's no point wow. in putting that in. You don't I get anything out of it. Wow, I should not say this. You should not say it. But we're edgy. <laughs> that's a little... That's Says who? <laughs> when are we edgy? No, there's not been a single comment. Every comment that's been about us being edgy. What about this has podcast like, is edgy? <laughs> we're edgy. They're not, we're not edgy, bro. Should we change the name to Safe Haven? Dude, just keep it on safe haven so you can keep Whoa! living your fantasy He's edgy. It's unsafe. So now we're going to do it to me? Okay. He's edgy. <laughs> All right, guys. That was funny. He's living on the edge. That was funny. <laughs> I just got that. That was funny. <laughs> I was, I was, con I was uh, contemplating just completely flipping you back, but I didn't want you to hurt your head. All right, guys. I think I'm going to call, call huh? it a day. Do you, you don't have, do you you don't have any more, like, eyelash. super polarizing takes for us? Got something yeah, on your eyelash. <laughs> What's on my eyelash? Get it off. Do you have any base takes? You got it. <laughs> Guys, make sure you always let your friends know when they have something, like, on their face. You have, like, an ugly face. Once it's again, you got to start <laughs> thinking before you say the things I'm you're kidding, saying. I'm kidding. So is this how we're just gonna? End okay, every no, we're not ending every episode on the walk off. So I'll end the episode. All right. And toodles. Peace. Bye. All right. Now that the weird kid's gone, um, do you want to be my co-host forever? <laughs>